Howdy YouTube, this is Charles from Our Tiny Cabin Project, and today we are going to be doing an experiment that could save you quite a bit of money when it comes to protecting your electronics. Stay tuned. Before we get started, go ahead and hit that subscribe button so that way you can stay tuned for all our future videos. Also, we presently have a 1,000 subscriber giveaway going up until next week. So today what we're going to do is we're going to take a look and see if tin foil will work as a Faraday cage, as well as maybe possibly dispel a prepper myth that has been fluttering around the community for quite some time now. What you're going to need to do this experiment is some napkins and tin foil. Don't get too excited, Rob MC. We know how you like the tin foil. Okay, so the first thing we're going to do is show you that both phones are working. I'm calling John. And it's ringing. Now we want to. Now we want to black out John's phone. To do this, we're going to take some tin foil. And a napkin. The trick is the electronic device cannot be touching any of the metal. I'm doing this live so that way you all can see that there's nothing special being done here. Fold the tin foil over in half. Set the phone in the tin foil, fold it over, fold it over, fold it over, fold it over. Let's call them again. Just kidding. You know what to do. Leave a message after you're done. Straight to voicemail. Very interesting. Okay. Unwrap the phone. In there. His phone's back online. Will a microwave work as a Faraday cage? Alright, now the question is, is, will our filthy, dirty microwave that we use to radiate our food work as a Faraday cage, blackout box, whatever you want to call it? No. Very interesting. Well, there you have it. Tin foil or tissue will work as a Faraday cage or blackout box or bag or whatever you want to call it. A microwave will not. Well, I hope you enjoyed today's video. And be sure to enter the giveaway. We're going to be doing the drawing really soon. If you've came up with any creative solutions to make your own, Faraday cage or blackout box, blackout bag, leave it in the comments below. As always, this is Charles with Our Tiny Cabin Project.
catch you later.